Let me put him out. Put your hands out. I'll close it. And throw it in. Good job. Yeah. Yeah. Long Island used to be a lot of duck farms. In fact, if you go out by Riverhead, they have the big ceramic duck. The ducks do what ducks do, and it just you know, polluted the, the water. Nobody thought of anything back then. The fourth and cross. There you go. Put him in. So I remember years ago, you know, you'd maybe throw a bottle in the water and not even think about it. I think people are more uh, conscious of that. Uh, I think measures the, the state and local governments have taken to clean it up uh, have paid off and will pay off. And, but again, people themselves have to practice it. Go. Good. Good job. Let him swallow. Yeah. <sighs> These fishies are smart. I love this area. This, this area, I've been coming here with my, my dad when I was a little boy. This is our first fishing trip as just us, just the two of us. We're supposed to be sick. There's more blowfish here than snappers, but it's good to see them. Right here, this spot, I caught a sea bass. And he wasn't big, he was about that big, but it was my first bass that I've ever caught, so I was excited, but I threw him back. Took my bait off! They took your bait off. Oh. Hadn't seen the blowfish in the past, oh God, 10, 15 years. And over the past several years, there has been an increase in their population. The conservation efforts of everyone involved has really improved the water and I believe it will keep on improving and my grandson and his children will have a great place to fish. You can't ask for a better place to bring up a child than near the water. I'm interested in having him, my grandson and his children catch fish here as I did. Okay, what do we say? <laughs> it counts, it counts, you had him.